stop and think. If you have the time to pass younger deer, and if you get excited waiting for the mystical stag, hallelujah for you. But what man has the audacity or the right or authority to tell that man or that child or that woman that when they got up early and they practiced with that shotgun or that bow and they're excited to get out in the woods and they have a deer license, who could possibly think they could have any control over this person's choice, whether he shoots that spike or not? If that spike thrills that person, maybe he's only got that day to hunt, maybe he's only got an occasional day, he's got two buck tags, who could possibly say, no, I'm sorry, you can't shoot that deer. I decided. That is one of the worst failures of mankind, giving, arbitrarily believing they have the authority over someone else's choice in such a personal endeavor. So we are of the ilk, because I get to hunt all, all the time. I hunt every day and I can wait for a mature buck because I know that if I let the young bucks go that we'll have a nice continuing production of stags that have a certain mysticism to them and it's more challenging. But for the person who wants that spike, God bless you, shoot the spike. If it makes you happy, you're reducing the herd, which is one of our main goals. You're enjoying the outdoor rec recreation. You're investing in this huge sportman, sportsman's economy. Who could possibly find fault with that person, regardless of age or gender? Who could possibly find fault with the happiness that person achieves shooting that little four-corn butterball buck? You have to find, again, I use the term lunatic fringe, a really selfish elitist that would dictate his preference of hunting, methodology or target, onto someone else. No one has that authority. No one has that right. And it has also discouraged people from, from becoming participants. It's, it's and I've had people way. quit because people get harassed. Why'd you shoot that buck? What a, what a nasty attitude. When you accomplish that incredible challenge of killing a deer with a bow or a gun, it's time for a celebration. I don't care what the dimensions or age might be. When it comes to other people's choices, shut up.